Hello friends, with the first uh, sunny days since uh, six months I would like to show you my polyhive update today is 21st of April 2019 the bees are flying for a second day actively like you see today activity is high and my uh, update for uh, today is uh, this winter from that side what you see here I lost two colonies one here and one here those were package bees that I bought last year from Chile from three packages I bought only one survived that one the rest this is a nucleus i made this is nucleus i made with my own queens and my conclusion is the package bees they don't survive here everybody who intend to buy bees from overseas who will lose maybe 50 60 percent like i did here even the conditions are much better than outside uh, colonies uh, in the Langstroth hives that side is more sunny like you see activity is higher and that side I lost also two colonies one here and one small nucleus there out of 15 colonies this winter I have four dead here that's the truth the reason I find this the one that I have it here was made uh, too late end of uh, July it was not so strong it died from uh, weakness that one was very strong colony four corpuses of bees they died I think they had some trachelmite infection or something like this because when in the springtime I didn't find uh, many bees dead on the floor they were going outside and they were throwing themselves uh, on the snow the rest that survived are very strong they have 15 frames of bees right now because the conditions inside they were better than outside and uh, bees survived well here I have two small hives worry hives that I was thinking that they will die because they were so weak but they survived and now they are bringing pollen actively uh, all of them they were young queens made by me from uh, natural queen cells I'll show you how the hive looks from inside you see the temper temperature is plus 16 today inside is plus 12 it's going to get plus 16 today and it will keep it plus 16 all night which is very big advantage you see the hive there they have two stories completely packed with bees those one is dead I use like a storage for frames with honey those also are very strong this is also very strong I made it uh, from queen from natural queen cell which I like the most those ones are nooks which are medium size uh, strength and I'm going to open the hive how it's going to look from it, from the bottom to show you let's see this one how it looks like like you see plenty of bees this is two stories 16 frames see what that system I have easy access 
the bees that came out they flew away from the door and uh, no no one attacked me you see this hive you see the the bee on the floor yeah. this one also has bees but not so much in the bottom see no one attacked me the, those one that they came out they will fly this way I don't at attract robber bees I don't uh, activate robbing now in the springtime the robbing activity it will be higher that's my update for today I think I had a pretty successful year and my conclusions are uh, all those colony empty spaces uh, I'll fill up with my own mate nooks with my own queens I'll not buy any more package bees or uh, nooks from uh, anyone around because it's the risk of infections they bring other diseases and even with that improved conditions in this uh, hive here I have mortality in my other yard uh, with the worry hives only I have zero mort mortality because all the queens are made uh, by natural way it's, uh, I didn't buy any packages there and I have zero mortality here I bought uh, last year all those uh, colonies to fill up the hive but I have four colonies uh, which are dead I hope next year with my two units that I have now I will have better rate successful uh, uh, survival rate because I will improve the conditions uh, of overwintering on uh, the my own bees are not gonna have that mortality rate thank you very much have a good day